Hello, this instructional video will be how to connect a Sonos Play Bar. I have a 2017 purchased Sonos Play Bar without the HDMI output on it to a, an LG OLED C8 uh, purchased this year or last year, 2018, in December. So, right now, the Magic Remote see if I can fit this in the screen. Sorry for the poor lighting. The magic remote is radial frequency and the Sonos play bar is infrared and there's the bottom right corner you can't really see it but there is a little optic there for um, infrared remote. So I'm gonna walk you through the steps um, of how to connect all this. I hope somebody can get some use out of it. Right now I'll let you listen to the original TV sound. It's good sound, but sounds better with all the speakers connected. So basically what you want to do, you'll go to your device connector. Sorry about that. Go to device connector, go to sound bar. The sound out option you want. You're going to choose optical for the older Sonos play bar since there is no HDMI cable. Gonna hit next and then next again. You're gonna scroll down you're gonna choose Philips. Somehow this tricks the Sonos play bar into reading RF versus IR. Hit next. It's gonna take you to this remote type screen at this point, you're going to go ahead and pull up your Sonos app. And you're going to go to Room Settings. Room Settings, I don't think you'll be able to see this because it's too close and my arm's not long enough. Let's see if I can go out here. Room Settings will take you to whichever room you're setting this up in. In this case, it's the living room. From the living room, I'll scroll down to Remote. It says TV and remote category. Click on the remote and the bottom choice is remote control setup. So I click on that and here it's going to say replace current remote. Before I do that I want to choose a remote type on the TV. I scroll over to remote type 4. I'm going to go ahead and push replace current remote on the Sonos app and then push continue. On the remote control setup it says hold the remote control point it at your play bar and press the volume plus button. So I'm going to point it at the volume button here on the television and press the volume plus at the same time and it has registered the remote. Remote control setup, the remote control has been recognized. You can now use a remote control or any Sonos controller to adjust the volume and mute of your Sonos speakers while you're watching TV. You go ahead and push done. Now I'll push next and you'll see the sound bar under Philips. We push done. Go back to our Willy Wonka show. And resume. And from here, we now have full control of the Sonos Play Bar. Up the air I don't know if you can hear the difference from before, but we now have surround sound in the living room. And that's how you do it. I hope this helps anyone with the old Sonos Play Bar and a newer OLED LG TV.
Thanks for watching.